Let's dive into large-scale water temperature patterns. Our eyes are on the waters just off the western coast of South America. You can see some blue on the map. That means that those temperatures are below normal. And when you get into those below normal water temperatures, you're thinking about La Nina. A La Nina needs several months where that water temperature is half a degree below normal. And those odds of us reaching that criteria have increased 71% between October and December. That's thanks to those easterly winds off the waters, helps to bring that cooler temperatures up to the surface, that upwelling. And these large scale patterns have implications on our winters as well. Here's what typically happens under a La Nina pattern. That jet stream dives in over the continental portion. We're dealing with probably a mild La Nina, so it may modify the schematic to some degree.